Hello and welcome back here to the channel. I'm Evil Rabbit. We are here on Forza Horizon 5 to do the first drift build wheel spin episode here on the channel. So make sure you guys follow me on all social media, all of the transcripts box below. If you guys are not subscribed to the channel, I would appreciate the support. Tap that subscribe button. And as always, make sure you hit that like button to let me know if you guys like the video. More wheel spin videos and wheel spin drift builds coming to the channel. The first one of many here on Horizon 5. So let's get to it. So we're going to start off with our two super wheel spins for this episode. We're going to try and hopefully get a couple cars. If we get a couple cars, we'll pick one and do the drift build on it. So we're going to start with our two. Three big spins, three big prizes. This there is we a go. super wheel spin. Let's test it out. So we got a 2014 Jeep Cherokee. So I hopefully we get some other cars because, well... Um, doing a drift build on a Cherokee would be very, very interesting. So we have Ragani Zonda R. So that's actually a pretty big pool. So uh, the Zonda R and the Cherokee so far is what we have in our wheel spins. But we have eight more regular wheel spins. So let's see what other kind of cars we can get for this episode. Drift build, wheel spin, drift build. A Subaru BRZ, you know, that's an easy drift build to do. So now we have three cars we can pick from on this episode. What else we got? We got a couple more wheel spins to do. Uh, I'll take 300 grand. I'll take 300 grand any day, every day. So we got five more spins after this one. We got <laughs> a Lotus Spirit. That would be interesting to build. So we got a couple cars that we can actually do a wheel spin build on. Because we're going to pick one of them. And then we got a 1965 Pontiac GTO. Oh, we have all the cars to choose from. And a Morgan three-wheeler. So we're getting all these cars. Normally, I think we wouldn't get any cars in these wheel spins. But we're getting a lot of cars on the wheel spins. So we have a few cars to pick from. Uh, and I think we're obviously not going to go to the BRZ. Because that's just too easy. Morgan three-wheeler could be fun, but it could be also different. That Lotus is definitely very intriguing right now. 125k, so that is all she wrote for our wheel spins. So now we will go into our cars because we have a few cars that we collected on the wheel spins. So we have the Jeep Grand Cherokee. We have the Elan Spirit. Which I feel like will be the funnest thing to build. Then of course we got the Bugani Zonda R. And then of course we got that BRZ. But for today's episode I think we're going to do that Spirit. Just because it's different. So we can do a drift build on this Spirit. And see what we can put into this car in order to uh, make it drift. So we're going to drive it first off the rip and see... well. How it drives normally and then we will change it up and do the full drift build on it so let's uh switch to the wheel cams and uh let's get to it so the little lotus here on horizon i don't think this car is gonna really do much off the rip oh man oh boy yep this car is gonna be uh very interesting to get to drift Oh, we're gonna buy a T-Bone? Oh, buy a Hoonigan car. Oh, this car needs massive amounts of power in order to do anything. Although we got a little bit of a slide going. Let's see what we can do on this little bit of a slide. Oh, second gear one wheel peel. Oh, the one wheel peel is for real with this car. Oh, this car is definitely need a huge adjustment in order to actually change this up. So let's go do some upgrading to it. We're going to go back home and we're going to do some upgrading to it and see what we can do. See if we can get this thing to go sideways for the first wheel spin drift episode here on Forza Horizon 5. Go upgrade. So you know the first two things we're going to have to do to this thing is not that we're gonna have to go tires we have to throw on 
some drift tires. If we have the option. Yep, they're right there. Drift compound tires. And then, of course, we need to throw in the drift suspension. Hopefully, this thing drops it. Rally. Drift suspension. That is super tucked. Uh, that is very tucked. So, what kind of motor upgrades or conversions can we do to this thing? So, we can throw in a 3.6 inline, a 3.2 inline 6, a 2.0 inline 4 VVT, or a 1.6 liter turbo rally. So, we're going to keep it with the factory motor and just hope we can get a lot of power out of this thing. So, we're going to throw as much power at this thing as we can on factory build it sounds like an angry bee uh yep we're just throwing as much power as we can on this thing let's throw that on there little flywheel on there and then we're gonna go into braking we're gonna leave that all there but we are gonna do a clutch we have to do a differential they have a drift diff now oh uh, that's something new a uh, drift diff okay and then we'll do a standard we'll do a sports transmission We'll throw dry carbon drive shaft in there. So where are we at right now at 47,000 on this car? We're at 320 horsepower, but only 1,500 pounds. So we're going to see what this does. And if we have to add a snail to it, we will. Definitely want to keep the stock motor in this thing. I mean, I kind of like the stock wheels on it too. But what body upgrades can we do? Up oh, just Forza Aero. All right. So we're not going to do any of that. I can increase the front track, so we are going to do that because, well, drift life, wider front. And we're going to see what we can do with this in this current state because I am not sure we may have to add a snail to this thing. Okay, alright. Maybe not. The drift suspension is not giving as much angle as I thought it would. But we're going to go full send here. Second gear. Kind of bogs in third. But for a little little car, it's not doing too bad. <laughs> Do we have any drift zones we can go tackle? Is the main question. I don't know if we have any drift zones. If we do, they're probably all the way up here somewhere. We don't. I don't think I have any drift zones unlocked. I'm actually uh, need to unlock a bunch of drift zones, so we're gonna have to continue the Let's Play series. But we're gonna continue to drift this car in its current state. I don't think it really needs a turbo. But then again, this thing is so small. And I think that's the best part about it. It does not weigh much. There's a convoy of cars. Look, it's Eddie. I'm going to try and hit up this big bank turn up here. Third gear. Oh. Just got a banging red line. <laughs> an old car? This thing rips. Kind of wall tapping up there. I can't see where I'm going. Actually quite impressed with this thing right now. You guys want to keep seeing drift Wheel spin drift episodes here on the channel. Let me know down in the comment section down below. This is actually pretty fun.
where can we go that we have not been yet? And maybe we can get some other twisty roads. Well, we're going to go this way. Because there's some twisty roads. And it looks like we may hit some off-road. So we're going to flip this around. Unlocking some skill points with this car, too. Drifting through traffic? What? Uh oh, we're going to hit that? No, we're not. We are, like, small and mighty. This car is... Right. Just screaming. But I am so surprised how this car is handling with the drift suspension and the drift dip. And this is on a basic tune. We're not touching anything right now. This is the out of the box tuning with just the drift suspension tune and the drift dip tune. Let's see if we can stretch this thing out a little bit. Oh, it didn't like that. Oh, we did not like that uh, little handbrake chuck. All these driving tires up here. Got Slap Train driving a... Uh... Oh, look, it's another one. Oh, we took off his license plate. Slap Train driving an old truck. You know, for... <laughs> Out of all the cars we could have gotten in this episode... This is probably the funnest one to build. We could have built the BRZ, which is just a basic... Everybody knows how a BRZ drives, but this thing? This thing's impressive. I will take this car in a heartbeat. We actually want to hit up some of the dirt twisties, so we're going to do that real quick before we do this episode. Make sure you guys follow me on all social media, all of you in the description box below. As always, I thank you guys for coming back and watching. Tap that subscribe button if you're not a subscriber. I would appreciate all the support. Just a tap on that guy. We're going this way. Taking this thing in the dirt. Drift tires. In the dirt. Oh man, this thing's like a little rally car. Oh, oh as I say that, we're getting a little squirrely. We got this. This thing actually handles pretty well on the dirt. I am actually very impressed Turn with this. When it is safe to do so. so I think that'll do it here on this episode of Forza Horizon 5. Little wheel spin, a drift build for the first time here on Horizon Horizon 5. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys want to see more, let me know down in the comment section down below. As always, I thank you guys for coming back and watching. I'm Evil Rabbit. Oh boy. I'll see you guys on the track. Oh, we dead by a Bronco.